Yeah, you have 15 here. grand to the winner here. Ten flights to be jumped. Two and a half miles. Deep sensation turns there. Deep sensation. Right, come on. Now ridden by Richard Dunwoody. And he's just uh, starts a little bit behind the others, but uh, Jamaica Bay takes it up right away. Jamaica Bay followed by Eurizen and Nick Dam on the inside. Jamaica Bay from Eurizen and the Nick Dam. Little gap then to Hyde of Fun. They're really going a gallop, and incidentally, they created a track record in the last race. It looked as though they were going to too, didn't it, when Clever Folly won? And they're rattling along here with uh, Blythe Miller as partner Jamaica Bay, having jumped really big and enthusiastically at the first two, takes them along at a really blistering gallop from Eurozone and Nick Dam on the inside. Then comes Deep Sensation with Height of Fun on Deep Sensation's outside. And behind them come Naha, with on the outside then Morley Street and Indian Baba between horses and Jamaica Bay really settling up settling a bristling pace here from Eurozen in second. I'm going to get into trouble from uh, David Ellsworth if I don't call it Eurizen, but I've just got in the habit of calling it Eurozen, so apologies, David. You won't worry if it wins. Jamaica Bay, the leader from Eurozen in second as they come to this flight. And comes Hyde of Fun in third and over on the far side is deep sensation and deep sensation being followed on the on the rail by Naha as they come to the fourth and Jamaica Bay and Blythe Miller still taking him along at this cracking pace from Eurozen in second then Ick Dam and then towards the near side height of fun and deep and sen deep uh, sensation over on the far side being followed by Morley Street and Indian Baba and Nahar and Jamaica Bay with a two-length advantage from Eurozen. Dam comes next, then Hyde of Fun and Deep Sensation on the inside of Morley Street and then Nahar and Indian Baba. Another complete circuit in this Mercury Communications Challenge hurdle. Running downhill, Jamaica Bay re maintaining this cracking gallop with great zest too. Eurozen in second, Hyde of Fun on the outside of Ick Dam in, uh, in third, in fourth rather, then in fifth is Deep Sensation. Over the next, Indian Baba, Morley Street making good ground on the outside, and uh, Nahar is just the back marker at the moment, racing to number six of the ten flights in all. Jamaica Bay for America from Eurozen. Deep Sensation on the inside of Ick Dam, Indian Baba, Morley Street towards the outer, height of fun, and Nahar. Number seven, Jamaica Bay lands in the lead from Eurozen. Swinging left-handed now. And Blythe Miller on this Jonathan Shepard trained uh, challenger for America, still the leader and quite a clear leader at this stage from Eurozen and Deep Sensation, three to jump. Ick Dam, then Naha making good ground on the inside, Morley Street hasn't been unleashed a bad jump there by uh, and uh, a fall of the Nahar has gone at that one Nahar a fall of there but the rider's up all right and the horse is up all right and Jamaica Bay is still the leader Jamaica Bay from deep sensation with making ground uh, towards the outside and coming to join the lead, Ick Dam. Then comes Eurozen on the outer. Morley Street is making quite significant progress now, but still Jamaica Bay with the advantage. Jamaica Bay from Eurozen on the outside. Between those two is Ick Dam. Then coming there, Deep Sensation in four, five now. Morley Street, the favorite, as they jump the next. Ick Dam, two out, has come to challenge Jamaica Bay. Eurozen on the outside, and Morley Street still hasn't been unleashed by Jimmy Frost. Eurozen and Ick Dam has taken it up now from Jamaica Bay, but Morley Street is coming there very significantly on the stand side as they've got one flight left to jump in the Mercury communications hurdle. Ick Dam is the leader being pressed now by Morley Street and Jimmy Frost with a double handful towards the stand side on Morley Street. Ick Dam from Morley Street as they come to the final flight. 
Ickdam and Morley Street. Morley Street lands in the lead from Ickdam and Morley Street quickening. And here's a good horse. And Jimmy Frost, who had that unfortunate experience earlier on, is certainly effacing the memory of that now as Morley Street strengths up towards the line. Morley Street is the winner. Deep sensation is going to be second and Ickdam third. And Eurozen four, and that's the one, two, three, four in the Mercury Communications hurdle. Morley Street and Deep Sensation. The one, two, and the result. First number two, Morley Street, owned by Salehurst Paper Company Limited, trained by Toby Boarding and ridden by Jimmy Frost. Second was number four, Deep Sensation, owned by Mr. R.F. Elliott, trained by Josh Gibbon and written by Richard Dunwoody. And third was number five, Ickdam, owned by LBI Law 873 Limited, trained by Richard Holder and written by Nigel Holman. And four is number nine, Eurizen. So Morley Street, a very impressive winner, another very fast time indeed. Winner of seven of his ten races. And number 10 of the season for Toby Balding. Number 11 for Jimmy Frost, who had that shocking fall early on in the afternoon. Still got up gamely.